All right, so um, once you've collected your uh, herbs and uh, flowers, oops, we got a sp bra spider. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to take it back outside. You want to cut your uh, herbs, oops, your sense isn't very sharp, um, no. at a, at a um, 45 degree angle to, um, to uh, make sure that they, uh, they uh, take up wa water easily. And uh, you want to clip off um, any uh, sort of excess uh, foliage um, so they can uh, can uh, sit in the solution uh, easily because um, uh, any like leaves left below the surface of the water will uh, create like a rot type of situation. So just trim those off. And again, oops, sorry, I gotta do this up here. So just trim that. This isn't very sharp. Yeah, make sure you sharpen it before you start to use it. And uh, yeah, it's letting me sit in there nice. Uh, and the excess stuff, um, you can add to your compost pile or uh, save for medicinal use. Or in a tea or something. Um, oh, this is terrible. Um, yeah. Again, trim, trim off the excess of oregano. That. And uh, so this is this is actually um, wormwood. Wormwood. Um, there's a wood, worm. wormwood, yeah, okay, sometimes I get backwards, um, used in absinthe, but also anti-parasitic, and uh, this is, uh, ladies bed straw, acts as a, um, as a replacement for rennet, a vegan, uh, rennet. Ladies' bed straw. And it, yes, it was originally used as a bed straw. All right, chop grease. Good for lucid dreaming. Put it on your pillow. And uh, it's supposed to keep you partially awake while you fall asleep. So you can lucid dream. You can also make a tea out of it, but I haven't had any success with that. I'm going to try the pillow thing next. You can make little satchels. Um, satchels? Satchels. Um, that can work too. Pillow sort of thing. Um, mugwort, as the name implies, uh, was originally used in beer uh, in place of hops, bamboo, and all the soap. Um, they actually make there, or there actually is. Um, a type of bamboo that can survive in Wisconsin, believe it or not. It dies back, but come, come spring, summer, it's back in full force, and it survives on the north side of my house, which is amazing. Okay, and the last one, um, comfrey, is a mineral powerhouse. Uh, this stuff supposedly um, mines minerals uh, from the soil. So it uh, has a bunch of uses as a fertilizer or as a uh, compress. So yeah, but 
the male name was just here, so that's why I cut. Um, so yeah, so lots of good stuff. Okay, so we'll leave this sit for about a week or so, uh, watering it um, as it as it dries out. And um, if you get sour stomach, uh, salt will help. Um, you can look up why that is. So we'll leave that. It's a nice little table piece. Very tricky, but hopefully that'll uh, liven up. And I think that's it. That's all you have to do. And um, uh, that's all for for uh, this part of the process. So we'll fast forward two weeks, um, then we'll see what happens.